Good morning everyone, I'm Professor Code and this is Forex Supermodel Racing Review and Forex Briefing for Wednesday the 26th of uh, July 2023. Yesterday we had a, a couple of races at, uh, on so for Tuesday the 25th. Mostel Bro were on the uh, 305, on this number 3 Initio which came third at 5-1 to one, which was a pain in the neck because we had two places on it. Uh, so we had a win at 6.777 so uh, uh, just above 13 to 2, so it was pretty good. Uh, and the two places at 1.78, about 7 to 4. But it was an FTO, it was a first time outer, and uh, we gave it as much rope as we could, and it still uh, fell short. So, a uh, bit of a dog that horse, uh, so we lost that. Uh, and then uh, the Musselboro last race, uh, 520, number 6, Cuban Rock, uh, the winner, but it uh, threw a plate uh, and uh, basically uh, got seen off. Uh, on the line so uh, sometimes circumstances just conspire against you and you do, you do sort of wonder uh, what, what you got to do to actually get a break sometimes but anyway that was that so we got uh, a win at three to one uh, drifted out to about seven to two and then came back in to uh, what was it eleven to four uh, and we had uh, two places again at uh, 0 0.81 uh, due to a number in the race uh, so we managed to get that uh, the sort of token gesture of uh, 0.81 uh, winner, so uh, we had four pound per eight pound unit, 400 pounds for us, uh, half unit exposure. And if you're on the minimums, you uh, you lost two pounds 20, uh, and we lost 220 pounds. So the account came down yet again to 74 and a half units, approximately in profit from a peak of 79 and a half. So that was that. Uh, so we got both barrels there, slaps across the face, and uh, door in the face. So, uh, what's the next thing? Uh, horse first modeling then. You've got this one here at Lingfield 510, this number six star proof, uh, but it's the five to six favorite. So we're gonna give that the chop. So uh, it, uh, whether it wins or otherwise, uh, we're not gonna get involved at five to six, but uh, uh, if you wanna look at it, it's Lingfield 510, it's, uh, it's the number six star proof. That's one of our horse first model horses. So they've actually got it out, but the odds are screwed off. So, uh, but the, uh, we've got another race first uh, uh, race here. We're on the first race at Bath, 2.30. It's a restricted maiden filly stakes for uh, band C and D, class five, three to five year olds, eight furlongs, good to soft. Now, uh, Bath uh, over, over eight is, is pretty slow, uh, model 93. It's the equivalent of Wolverhampton 8 and Southern 8 on the all-weather in terms of surface pace profile. Something to bear in mind. Now, there's two, uh, there's two FTOs in there which we're, which we're having to go at as well as another one. So uh, we're on three horses in that race. We're on uh, Certain Style, number two. Uh, where is it? Uh, certain Style. Uh, and, uh, and we're on... Uh, so the two FTOs are Sierra... Pearl and uh, another realm. So they their first time outers, uh, and this certain style uh, is uh, is um, has had, had a couple of runs. So uh, we've got a pound win at fourteen to one, uh, a pound win at five point six to one, and a pound win at uh, eight point eight to one. So three pounds on, and the minimums zero point three seven five exposure. Uh, there's five in the race, so we've got point six. 60% of the runners, and we're missing this uh, short price favourite, which is, um, uh, where is it, uh, Rose Bolt. Uh, what do we know about Rose Bolt? Um, if we can find it. Uh, uh, Rose Bolt, uh, Lingfield 8, uh, Novice, and uh, um, uh, Subtle or Weather, uh, Maiden 10k race. It looks, it looks like it's... Uh, it's got potential to be taken on, and these are the horses that are going to do it as far as we're concerned. So uh, we're spreading it around, uh, and that's where we are there. Now the forex uh, yesterday we got a bounce trading uh, on um, uh, euro dollar, uh, and uh, we didn't make much, but we we, we chipped away. Uh, and today you've got the forex uh, FOMC uh, Fed Federal. Uh, uh, market committee uh so you've got you've got an interest rate decision there it's going to be uh everybody's going to be running scared of this at uh, six or seven o'clock this evening so and then you're going to get wild volatility so uh we'll probably stay out and just watch it uh, and uh, let the market chew on it for tomorrow which is the um ecb rates decision we'll probably have a go at 
a bounce trade on the ECB on Thursday. So that's where we are. So yesterday uh, we we got uh, uh, you know it was a hard luck story. Today uh, we're on uh, our horse first model is uh, is the odds are too tight, and on the uh, uh, race first model we're on three uh, two FTOs and another one. Uh, against two others, a uh, short price favourite and outsider. So uh, we've only really got one horse to beat, uh, and that's this. Uh, what is it? Um, if I can find it, Rose Belt. So uh, let's hope that uh, uh, we can do that with one of ours. So uh, that's where we are. Thanks for watching. Thanks for subscribing. And uh, by the way, thanks for the, thanks for liking it on there. I think that does make a difference if you press the thumbs up button. Um, uh, obviously, you have to like it. Uh, but anyway. Uh, that's where we are, so thanks for watching, thanks for subscribing, goodbye.